We are Dave and Tiff and in this series we are travelling in our motorhome Roma with our two dogs Zena and Luna and we are heading off for France, Spain and Portugal. Hope you enjoyed this series. Setting off from the Dieppe Air that we managed to get in last night and we are not going to be doing a... Um... Alright Zena. You want to contribute? We are not going to do an evening ferry again. Mainly because in the dark the boat slows down so instead of a four hour ferry crossing it is five and a half hours. Plus being stressed we were worried about getting onto the air at midnight once we di disembarked from the boat. It was a bit stressful trying great. to get in here. But it's great isn't it? It's so the block big, it. the big guy's going to block us in now. Going to get He's Belgium actually. I thought he'd have been quite so rude. Right, well, he could let me out, couldn't he? Yeah, hold on. Let's start this one again. Rude. I'm not going to get out there, am I? <laughs> sake. That's my German. lot, mate. It's coming back a bit. Thank you. Thank you, Shen. As you can see, we're still a bit tetchy and stressed. Right, leaving Dieppe's air uh, and it was 14.30 for the overnight stop. Um, oh, there's Yeah. Distracted already. Um, yeah, it was quite noisy, the road noise of the time the ferry comes in and out. Take exit to Key de la Thank you. And we're heading off as far south as we wish to go today, depending on how busy the, depending how busy the roads are. Right, let me concentrate, big co-pilot for a bit. We are taking the um, route around Rouen, which I know a lot of people um, try to avoid at all costs. Anyway, this is the way we go. We've gone down from Dieppe along the 27, A1 one and A150 and then we pick up the N338 I think it is to go around Rouen. Anyway we'll try and try and video bits of it for those that are daft if enough to do it. No, no it's, it's not that bad if you do it the right way. No I know <laughs> but a lot of people then no. come unstuck they do. because they've got low bridges etc. But it hasn't been too bad. I'm not going to say it's not bad. Because we never know if we go wrong either. No, exactly. So we shall see. I'm just going to amend what I said. It's the N1338 that we head for. And it's about a mile away from here. And we've just passed the E Leclerc on the right. So we're going around Rouen on the western side and crossing the river over the big cable stay bridge. I think it's also got signs for A13, hasn't it? Um, yeah. I don't remember. But we will be picking up the little toll road, A13, because it's a lot easier. There's the, the bridge just coming up. You can see the cables oh, yes, and the supports. I can see the bridge we're going to go over. Le Plant Flaubert. Bears off here. Yeah, both lanes go on the 150, do they? I don't know. What does your iPhone say? It doesn't show me lanes, it just says to side right. Yeah, both lanes go this way. And 1338. I think it was two lanes, but it had um, roadworks, isn't it? That's a bit confusing because you think you should be in that lane. Which takes you into the town. Right, we're about to go over the bridge. Oh, I see, they come into us. Yeah, so we're going all the way around, aren't we? Yeah, we need to get in the other lane. Uh, Which, of course, is not going to let you in. No. Let's 
the new woman. Rude. Yep, we're gonna go your side after we get to the bridge. Off the bridge. Oh. In 400 meters, slide right. Let's do a quick show. 500 yards ahead, and circle, take second exit towards Le Mans. Follow those trucks. Oh, not him. He's in the wrong lane. Oh, no, he's not. We're just stopping. Thought he was changing lanes there. Oh, look, they must be doing a bypass. Yeah. That's what they're building there. That will make it easier. Hmm. Certainly will. Well, Bound to be a toll, though. Go over to your side now. Turn left onto Rue Fri Barbie, then turn left onto Rue Fri de Carlo. There's the sign A13 and Le Mans. There we go all the Turn left onto Rue Fri de Carlo, then slide right to Rue de Madagascar. Turn left on Rue de Madagascar. Slide right at Rue de Madagascar and then we go and back then round right to your side again. It's even more complicated now because, because of this road works. It. It, <laughs> it probably won't be like this again. No, it probably won't. This one. Yep. Yeah. A13 again, isn't it? Yeah. Then slide right onto Bois Repeat Su3. We have just joined the A13, um, the toll road. And as much as we like to not to do toll roads, sometimes it's just the most obvious way. Especially if you want to put some miles under your belt. Here comes the toll. Need to get me money. How much are you going for? Mm. I know how much it was last time. Okay, 12. I think it was 20 last time. Whoa. And four for the next little bit. Right, which one do I go for? Oh, the one with the card. 17.1 miles ahead. And one you Stay can fit. That's either of them, isn't it? Yep. No, it's that one. Yeah, this one, Fred, this one's fine. I go. I don't know how much it was. It wouldn't give me a ticket. I'll have to check on that. It was £3.9 on the top. On the A13 little section. In pounds. Yeah. We are now on the N154. And as you can see, a really busy road. What have you just said? If only every tarmac road surface was like this in our van it's so smooth the only thing I can hear rattling actually now is, is, the, <laughs> is the steering wheel crook lock oh in the back yeah I'm surprised you didn't say your wife hasn't got a brain to rattle oh no now come on behave I'll give you more credit <laughs> Can't be far from here now, must be where that car is, it's just gone down. Oh, well mine's just a bit further over the river, is that right? Nope, oh. we don't go over the river. Okay. It's well. one of these coming up. Your phone is definitely having a meltdown today. Right, it's warm. Right, there's a sign coming up here now. Is it straight on? I don't remember it being down there, I think it's down the next one. Round about here. Well, you've just said my phone's having a meltdown. Camping Municipal, Camping, uh, there you go. Do go over the river? No, the river's there. In front, that, where that big bridge is, that's just a little tiny stream. Oh, well, that's what I meant. It's down this way. 
and we're just about to pull up to the camping car park site. You might be able to see the van through the trees. A few vans are in. Right, here I go. You thought it was the other one, didn't you? I did, yeah. Did you think your husband's a moron? Bonjour, welcome. Has it not got enough money on it? It has. It beeped. Well, this isn't very good. It's gone now. <laughs> you should have filmed that. Or did you? Well, just the beginning bit. Well, I have no idea oh, why it didn't work. Now. Should we check this bit out? You check it all out, Dave. You've been... well, we couldn't go down here because it was it all, was all um, ev yeah. taped off, wasn't it? It was. Might need a bit of shade today. We do, don't we? Well, we don't want to go by with... the kids' play area. Mind you, I could play on the slide and the swing later you if could, I wanted yeah. to. We could share the seesaw. Card oh. eventually worked, by the way, obviously, because we're in. <laughs> we eventually found our perfect pitch and stopped there. So, for our first day of driving, we made it as far as Chateau Dun. An overnight stop here before heading further south in France and next week you'll see us in a wonderful place called Bidart in the southwest of France. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, please like, share, subscribe and comment and we'll see you next time.